or welcome back to the studio. I've been really sick for the past couple of days, so if I seem weak and really out of it, it's because I'm sick and I don't have that much strength and energy, especially in my voice, so I hope that you can hear this. I'm resting for the past couple days and now that I'm, I'm kind of feeling a little bit better, I have some energy to sew and show you guys what I do in a day and what I sew in a day. I'm gonna give you a quick overview of the things that I have to sew today. So I have two shorts to alter. I have a prom dress to alter. I have to hem the skirt and then alter the, the straps, I believe. also have this, this dress. This is a gift for my cousin. I haven't worked on it. I was supposed to work on it last year, but uh, I didn't have time, but now I do. So I'm going to be working on this today. This is the same pattern as the one I did, the Barbie dress, the Barbie version of the My Ardor pattern. Uh, I love that pattern. It's beautiful. And and this is definitely her style. This is more of her style than it is mine. And she already came in for like a fitting. I just have to adjust the sides and then add the binding on the neckline and then the hem. And I, I'm also going to make a skirt today for my 7-year-old cousin. I think she's 7. With this beautiful fabric. This is 100% uh, cotton with beautiful, beautiful flowers. And um, I took her measurements already. I just have to actually make up my mind if I want to do a gathered skirt or a circle skirt. It's so colorful. It's perfect for her and her personality. It's perfect for spring because spring is coming up. There's a bunch of sewing to do. I'm not sure if I can finish it today, but I'll sew what I can. pants are done and they're not the best looking but it is what it is um, and I forgot that I had to do another short so I'm gonna work on this next So I sewed the binding for the neckline of this and I think I'm gonna stop right there I'm gonna have to ask my cousin to come and actually fit this one more time just because um, if it's too loose Right here, and that's gonna be too big on her bust area I'm gonna wait on this. So this is what it looks like so far, but yeah, it's supposed to look like this but I'm not sure if this is too wide. I feel like it is. And I don't know if it's this is too deep. So I might like cut over here. 
up to there if it does end up like being too much so yeah i'm gonna stop there for this dress and then i should really work on the prom dress i need to finish that soon i don't know i'm not in the mood <laughs> i'm not in the mood to do that right now so let me work on the skirt if i can finish that today it's actually several days later i haven't worked on any sewing the past week because i was just feeling so sick at the end of the last video that you watched i was feeling really really bad so i just focused on resting and drinking lots of water and recovering but thankfully um thank god i am very much recovered and i'm regaining my energy and my usual self back and it's also such a beautiful day outside the sun is out it, it hasn't been out I think the past two three weeks so I'm very happy that um, the Sun is out and it's shining outside and I should really get some Sun I haven't gone out yet um, maybe in the afternoon and take a, a nice walk or something like that but yeah I'm very excited so the last thing that I was working on was the skirt and um, we're gonna work on that today I have it right here I actually made a mistake on the way measurement so me and um circle skirts i don't know if we're friends yet but yeah because i keep making these mistakes with the circle skirts oh and the prom dress as well i didn't take any footage of me altering the prom dress but it's this beautiful like green shiny shimmery um beautiful dress i shortened the straps i hemmed um, the bottom of the skirt it actually took me the whole entire day to finish that one i couldn't really focus on filming it and doing that at the same time because it was it was a lot of um it was a lot of work so it was just an update but i already finished it and yeah we're gonna work on the skirt today which is right here um i decided to add last minute <laughs> my last minute decisions i wanted to add like ruffles on the bottom over here so we're gonna be adding ruffles but i have to fix the waist measurement first and i don't, I don't think that's gonna take that long
Okay, hi everybody. It is my last update for the day. Um, we are finished with the skirt, finally. It's currently 11.55 p.m. I feel so bad for my neighbors because I was surging the hem earlier and my surgery was so loud and it's like so late at night already. But I have to finish this. I don't want to work on it tomorrow because I need it to be finished today. I have a lot of projects to do. So yeah, this is um, the final look. It's It looks beautiful. Um, this is the front. And then this is the back side. It has a little ribbon right there. This is what it looks like in the back. Circle skirt and this is the front, and look at that. Of course, we gotta give it a good twirl. Yay! Okay, but anyway. So I was gonna originally do gathers for the bottom, but I didn't want to undo all my work putting it together because I was supposed to. From all things at once Without thinking twice And I knew it would catch up And that we would be the ones Left behind 